That's where the stage is, right? CC and Regina Yin surveying the damage today at their property in Vacaville. The stage we use have the American flag. For 28 years, Yin Ranch has been a popular event center for schools and rotary clubs until flames from the LNU fire forced the Yins to run for their lives. We got the emergency call from the county at 2 o'clock in the morning. That call spared their lives, but the Yins lost this scenic guest home on the top of a ridge and this historic hall that they call the American Dream Park. We talk about uh, the American dream of immigrants, like everybody else before us. Mm -hmm. uh, we feel we're thankful, we want to give back to America. But giving back will take some time because there are still hot spots here. And today we spotted this crew from Napa looking for embers. So this is something the incident's going to have to deal with for many, many days. Obviously, as the, the day heats up and the wind gets going, um, something that may look cold like this right, right now will heat up in the afternoon and has a, a, a risk of reigniting in this dirty burn area throughout here. But amidst all the devastation and destruction, you want dry ones? a ray of hope. The animals here on the ranch that fled the fire have all returned. We opened the gate, well, then they all they came, come, came they back, back afterwards. They all come we back. didn't lose any one of them. And fortunately, the Yins are insured, and they want any relief funds to go to fire crews that help save lives and property. And they do still have one dream left, to return to their ranch and make it better than ever before. As immigrants, they told us they see it as their patriotic duty. This country and is bottom line is really very strong, very beautiful, and, uh, and we want to maintain it that way. And, uh, and I think I am committed with my heart and soul. We build it and we can rebuild. And now you can see PG&E utility crews working hard to restore power here. And for the first time today, a little bit of a blue sky thanks to a breeze that has come through. In Vacaville, Mike Lurie, KCRA 3 News.